Hi everyone, it's Meher from Vancouver, BC, and welcome to my YouTube channel. The purpose of my videos is to introduce you to tips that will help you elevate your job search by interviewing experts in the field. And if you are a first time watcher, please subscribe to the channel so that you get the notification every day I post a new video. So let's start with today's interview. Hi everyone, welcome back to another interview series with me. Today I have the privilege to interview Mihai Naj. Hi Mihai, how are you doing? Hi Mayor, it's lovely to speak with you. I'm very well, thank you. Thank you for being here. So Pleasure. Mihai is a dynamic and energetic professional, a devoted partner and a happy father of two angels, a business catalyst who is passionate about ideas, people and the new way of work. So Mihai, can you tell us more about yourself, your career, what challenges you had to, uh, to face, and why you created HR Congress? <laughs> First of all, thank you for inviting me. I feel absolutely honored and privileged that you've, you've reached out to me on LinkedIn. Uh, in a nutshell, are uh, the two reasons why, well, going back my, my my working professional life, of course, probably like everybody else, you know, graduating university, started working for organizations, were not particularly happy about how uh, I was treated as an employee and I've always been sort of an entrepreneur spirit. So I wanted to uh, sort of uh, try myself out and, and just become an entrepreneur. I just, it, ever, ever, ever since I was born, I've been uh, selling stuff and, and that's, that's the world of what really inspires me. So that's, this is why I started my own business is going back to around 15 years or so as of uh, by now. And one of the reasons why I started Deja Congress, there are several reasons. One of them is, I'm a, as you mentioned, I'm a father of two young uh, daughters, now nine and six years old. And I want to make sure that when they grow up, they work for organizations and they work in a, in a happy and joyful environment, whether it's for working for themselves or working for organizations. But it's certainly something which they need to get uh, ready and prepared for, that the way we know work and our parents know work is drastically different. Um, and second of all, we are, with the Age of Congress, we are on a mission of uh, advocating and working with clients from literally around the world of designing and building people-centric organizations because we strongly believe, especially in, in, in today's, it's just so, the, the work environment is just so drastically and rapidly changing. There's no other way an organization can work unless they are people-focused, unless they have uh, proper structures and practices and, and, and processes in place to engage the right people because at the end of the day every organization is sort of sort of thriving towards becoming agile thriving towards becoming innovative or or thriving towards sort of sustainable in the future but organizations are neither agile nor innovative it's only people are people are in those organizations can be agile or innovative and you cannot tap on the full potential of people unless they feel they feel appreciated they feel happy and engaged at work yeah. So this was probably most most important reason why we started doing the Asia Congress uh, four years ago, which uh, by now is is has achieved. Uh, seems like it resonates really well with organizations because we are going to have about a thousand participants in Nice. It's more than a conference; it's more of a movement of really connecting like-minded global professionals. Mm -hmm. And companies are interested in learning more, mm -hmm. uh, connecting with like-minded professionals to to really how to how to create the best culture for their own people. Yeah, and so I believe- Long we did the introduction, but I hope I answered your question. Yeah, for sure. And I believe uh, the, there's a conference in coming few weeks, right? Correct, exactly four weeks from now, we shall be in Nice at our fourth conference. So very exciting. Okay, yeah, uh, I will leave a link of the conference in the comment section. And for the audience watching for the first time, so in the coming five days, we'll, I'll ask uh, Mihai some questions, uh, then you can share with us and you can join the journey. So if you like what you're watching, please uh, like and share, subscribe to the channel and tune in tomorrow for another question with Mihai.